is the crap goth my name is pixie and welcome to my channel of randomness where you never know what you're gonna get today is a surprise unboxing video and my friend has been to miniso for me and she's brought me this back so today we're gonna have a look what is inside it she dropped it off yesterday i've been very patient but today's the day to open it stick around but please do subscribe and hit that bell, bell icon so you know when the new video goes up and when i've stopped being so excited and can't actually speak i'll do the unboxing <laughs> Right, okay, so firstly, oh my god, yes, I am still in my pyjamas, I'm looking completely bedraggled and a frigging mess, but, oh my god, like, my studio is pretty much finished, I now have a dedicated podcast booth set up, I'm on Spotify Podcasts as The Crap Goth, please do go and give me a follow, um, so I have a beautiful little dedicated booth, I've been, I've been stapling, big massive, gadoom, 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 staplers, um, my husband built this booth for me with like, like a bit of a lid, roof, ceiling, whatever the fuck you want to call it. And I've got all these soundproof tiles, like one purple, one blackout, checkerboard style. Been sat there stapling those onto the walls and everything and the ceiling. We've got um, then spent ages with those like little LED strip light things on a big reel. Just peeling it and sticking it all up the wall and all around the podcast booth. So it all looks really cool. Pretty much everything is ready now, literally. It's just the finishing touches. So... I am filming for the next few videos in here, which is my living room, and then all of this will be gone. There'll be no more cuddly toys behind me, there'll be no sofas, and I will probably be dressed and everything, and I'll be in my beautiful studio with my Sanrio stuff around me and everything. It's gonna be so bloody cool. But anyway, this is just a short video. Like I said, my friend went off to Miniso, which I think is in Derby. It's recently opened up in Derby. And she brought me one of these boxes. And this is a mystery box. I think they were £15 each. And she went and got one for me because she's amazing. So this video is dedicated to my wonderful chat friend. I'm about to say, I was about to swear. I was about to call her a twat. <laughs> my wonderful twat of a friend, um, Cherry who I absolutely love so much. Like, we do so much together. We go to Harry Potter Studios. We're going again in a few weeks, which is amazing. She comes to the house to see me all the time because she knows that I'm an idiot and I can't leave the house by myself. And Tobias comes with her and Sean, so hi to them too. But this one is for Cherry because I just absolutely love her. And she she talks to the camera all the time. So, hi, Cherry. Hello. And I'm going to open this. I haven't opened it, see? It's completely sealed. So I'm going to do it with you guys now and see what we've got. So Cherry did say that she bought one for her daughter, Sean, and it was brilliant. Uh, I love Sanrio. Absolutely. As you can probably guess from all the Builder Bears behind me, I like my melody, Hello Kitty. I don't have the Hello Kitty Builder Bear, actually. I think I need to save up for that one. But I've got, I like Hello Kitty and um, my melody, Karomi, Cinema Roll, um, I, I like little twin stars as well. I'm not a big fan of Kropi. I definitely don't like I don't like Badsmaru. Not a big fan of them. Not a big fan of Pom Pom Purin either, but there's a few that I absolutely adore. So anyway, let's see what is in this box here because I know that Cherry said that she got quite a lot of Sanrio in hers. So okie dokie, oh my god. So this says Lucky, wait for you to find surprise. Mini so I'm gonna keep this box as well because it's so cool. But right, okay, so it has a little bit of cellar tape on there. Look, I haven't even undone that. Do I have scissors? Yes, I do. I'm gonna very carefully cut this one just so I can uh oh, look, I do it look so you guys can see very, very carefully. So I don't want to damage the box really because I want to oh there we go. Is it done it? Yes, it's done it. Right, I'm about to stab myself. So, you're seeing it as I'm seeing it. Let's see what is inside this one. I'm trying to be dead careful. I don't want to hurt the box. Oh my god. Are you ready? Oh my gosh. We've got a plushie. Oh, look at that. Look at the colours. Looks so cute. Right, okay. Let's have a look what we have got inside this one then. Let's move my scissors up way so I don't stab myself up the ass. Okay, so this looks like a really, really cool box for £15. So I can see straight away we've got our plushie in here. Now, plushies, you can look between £15 to £25 for a decent plushie. So we'll have a look at this one first because then this one's out of the way. And it is, it's a piece of cake. Oh my God, that is so bloody adorable. 
adorable and it's so soft as well it's got a little cherry on the top oh my gosh so this says this is mini so dessert and this says um we are the dessert family cream chocolate fruit we are everyone's favorites with us you forget your troubles and become happy oh my goodness look at that that is absolutely so good i love it and this is going to live in my studio obviously it is absolutely beautiful i love it and such a high quality really really high quality i absolutely love this plushie oh my god i love it it's my first mini so one and we've still got some stuff left super exciting okay look still got some stuff left in the box okay so next thing that we are pulling out is it is a pencil case or it could be like um a cosmetics bag or anything else it's quite a good size it's completely see-through on the front and the back which is really nice it's got some packaging inside just to keep the shape of it in there look you can see that's what that kind of like weird cloudy thing is and this is characters that i don't know i've never seen before it says fuwa if that's how you, I don't know if that's how you pronounce it, but that's how I'm saying it anyway. And this says, oh, it just says it's Fuwa Fuwa from Miniso. And welcome to the Chinese restaurant. Panda Chi Chi is gourmet. Piggy Zen Zen is a grumpy chef. Filled buns, dumplings and, and rice balls are all the specialities. Come and join us for a wonderful experience. So these are characters that I've never seen before, but that is really, really, really nice. Huge, actually huge case. You can fit your toothbrush, you can fit your makeup, um, you can put all kinds of toiletries in there, or you can fill it full of crafts, you know, your erasers, I don't want to say rubbers, but like um, all of your pens and your pencils and things like that. It's really cool. Or if you're like me and you collect stuff like miniatures and stuff or things for dolls, anything can go in that. That is really, really lovely. It zips, which is brilliant. And a huge capacity. Just look at that. Once we take out, get rid of that look. Chuck that away. But there we go. We've got the size of that. It's really, really spacious inside. That is absolutely beautiful. That would be a lovely shower bag if you go on a holiday. Brilliant. Love it. That is so super cute. So that can go there with the... Uh, let's put this on the back look so you can see it because that's so cute. Oh, there you go really really sweet that is okay the next thing we have is something that i can't use sadly but i might give this to my daughter this is a face mask this is a natural beauty moisturizing facial sheet mask and there we go so that one is there now i don't use these only because i've got super sensitive skin and covered in piercings and it's really difficult i can't put these over my cheek piercings because it irritates me massively so i don't use anything like this on my face but my daughter does and does it say what this is um I'm not sure it just I think it's tea I'm not quite sure oh, it's tea tree there we go so tea tree is fantastic for your skin and it smells bloody gorgeous so this one I'll go to my daughter Ebony because she loves all her cosmetics and stuff so that is really cool as well and then we have got oh yay things for your hair so obviously I might have to pinch the purple ones but these are sparkly hair slides obviously everything's from mini so it's all officially branded so these are one, two, three, four. You get five pairs of, oh, it says eight plus like age look. There we go, sparklies, which are really nice, like for your hair. And these ones will go to my little girl, Ostara, because she's got hair literally past her knees and she's only six and she loves her hair, like hair slides. But sometimes like this does my head in, so I might have to pinch a set of them. But they are really, really nice and really lovely quality as well. Proper sparkly, which is awesome as well. So again, really nice. And the next one is stationery. So anybody who knows me knows I'm a bit of a stationery whore and I absolutely love my pens and my pencils and my markers and fine liners. Oh my God, I love fine liners. I love them. And Sharpie pens. I can never have enough black Sharpies. I love drawing in black Sharpie. But this is a panda set and this has two pencils. Uh, a ruler, a pencil sharpener and a rubber or an eraser wherever you're depending where you're from and there we go it says animal faces on the back look and it is really really cute and do you know something really ah there we go I've already got a stationary bag to put this in which is so super cute that is a really really nice set love that that is ever so ever so nice still got more left which is really cool 
Ah, more stuff. Okay, so the next thing we have got are some scrunchies. My hair is not long enough anymore for scrunchies. I used to have dreadlocks right past my knees, but obviously I've got stress, alopecia, and my hair started to fall out. So my hair is not quite big enough for these, but my daughter's is. In fact, both, I've both, both my daughters are. Couldn't speak, they speak then. I'm stuttering. I have got such a bad stutter when I get excited. It's really annoying to have a speech impediment. So my eldest daughter is nearly 21 and she's got beautiful hair. And my little one is six and she's got beautiful hair. So I'm sure between them, they can fight these ones out. But they're really nice. They're really, really lovely. Beautiful texture. They've got a lot of elasticity to them as well. So they're really good quality. They're absolutely lovely. There's five on there, which is absolutely lovely. And um, we've got some silky ones, some kind of lacy ones, and some cotton feel ones. And yeah, all around, they feel like really, really beautiful quality hair things, which is brilliant. And if you don't want to wear them in your hair, you can wear them on your wrist and make really cool bracelets. Win-win for everybody. Right, okay, the last few items now are, oh, more hair things. So I, my little girl's going to be so happy because obviously like, I can't really do much with mine. But there are some bobbles, but not just that. Let me show you, look. These are like little, little bows. How cute are they? Look, all different colours. And they're all little bows with little kind of caps on. They are absolutely gorgeous. That one's a cute one. Look, that's glittery. That's really, really, really nice. So these are lovely. Obviously, my little girl will use those. I don't think Ebony would, um, just because they've got bows on. But they are so, so pretty. And again, you get one, two, three, four. You get five on there as well. They feel really, really lovely quality. And I like the fact they've got those little caps on the ends, which actually stops the bubbles from fraying, which is really, really pretty. So again, these are going to go for my little girl. She's going to be really, really happy when she gets to put some pretty stuff in her hair. And... And the very last thing is a notebook, which is cool. There we go. So it's completely empty now. And this one, oh my gosh, it's got fabric on it. It's actually got, this notebook's actually got stitching on it. I thought it was just an effect. It's not, it's actually stitched. So I'm open this one because I want to keep this one for myself. So I'll hold this up to the camera. Look, if you can see, see these, that's actual stitch. That's actually thread. How beautiful is that? Can you see? That is amazing. That's absolutely, the quality in that is beautiful. It's got almost a kind of wetsuit feel to it. What's that, um, that kind of wetsuit? Oh, I can't think of, completely brain farted on what it's called, but it's got like, like, like a neoprene. It's got almost, almost a kind of neoprene feel to it. And it is a lined notebook which is really, really nice. So obviously that's fantastic for making notes for my podcasts, for my YouTube, or just what I'm going to buy when I actually do get my arse to mini sew and actually go shopping rather than asking my friends to pick things up for me. But that is a really good haul. So we got a plushy cake. We got a um, like a embroidered notepad, which is really cool. Got some um, scrunchy bubbles, five of those, which is really, really good. We've got a see-through cosmetics case or pencil case, whatever you want to use it for. Got a panda stationery set, which is absolutely so cute and so lovely. We've got five hair bubbles, which have got those, those little metal caps on. We've got some sparkly hair slides, which are super, super cute. Really, really, really lovely. And we've got a face mask. And not to mention that, we've also still got a really, really beautiful storage box, which I'm going to save because it's amazing. And all of this for £15 for Miniso is absolutely incredible. I love it. I absolutely love it. I think my favourite item has got to be this cake, which is just absolutely adorable. I love cute stuff like that. So that is my mystery box. I've never had one of those before. I've never even been to Miniso before. It's been opened up in Derby for quite a while, which is my local city. But just because of my anxieties and things, I don't really get to go into a city very often. So yeah, my friend Cherry came round, um, I think it was a couple of days ago, and she said, I think it actually might have been yesterday morning, said, I'm going to go to Derby, I'm going to go to Miniso, would you like me to pick you up, mis um, up a mystery box? And I was like, oh my God, yes, please. And then she dropped it off for me yesterday and everything because she's brilliant. So yeah, that is absolutely amazing. Thank you so much. If anybody sees these in Miniso, they are 100% worth it. There's got to be about 40 or 50 pounds worth of stuff in there, if not more. But this was my favourite item. What was your favourite item from this unboxing? I think, oh my gosh, they're just so, so cute. And have you guys been to Miniso? Do you go a lot? 
Um, I know one of my friends who's a YouTuber, she goes um, to all these awesome places and I do watch a lot of her videos, but it's somewhere that I haven't been myself and I really want to go. My daughter's been before, um, so yes, I need to get my anxiety under control so I can actually go out shopping. But oh my gosh, Cherry, thank you so, so much. Miniso is amazing. I watch it on YouTube myself. I really want to go. So thank you for picking this up for me. I love everything. But again, this is my favourite. I'm going to call this Cherry just because it's got a cherry on the top and it's covered by my best friend. So there we go. Thank you so, so much. Thank you for watching. I absolutely love stuff like this. Mystery boxes are so exciting. So right, Honestly, get yourself over to Miniso, go and have a look. If you've got a mystery box you set up, please do comment down below. What did you get inside yours? Because I would love to hear. Right, okay, that is it for me. I'm going to go and play with all my new toys and put things away for our star effort in the morning. And thank you so much for watching. If you do like this channel, if you like what you see, which is dead random all the time, please do make sure to hit that little subscribe button and that bell icon again to make sure that you know when all, of, all my new videos come out, which is roughly every three days or so. So I shall see you all soon. And I'm going to be in my YouTube studio super, super, super soon. So you're going to see neon lights and lots of cute things instead of my living room. And it's so exciting. I shall see you all soon. And Cherry, I love you. I love you so much. Thank you so much. Bye-bye. See ya.